And I'm Russ McCaskey. We're glad you're with us. Religious freedom versus bank security. A civil rights group raises concerns after it says a Muslim woman was singled out at a Tulsa bank for wearing a headscarf like this one. Ten News reporter Sarah Goldenberg looked into what happened. Sarah. Valley National Bank said they told the woman that she would need an escort if she didn't want to take off the headscarf. Civil rights groups call this pure and simple discrimination. The Oklahoma chapter of the Council on American Islamic Relations, known as CARE, says a Muslim woman dressed in a traditional hijab was singled out at the Valley National Bank at 81st and South Yale in Tulsa. This idea that she had to have uh, an escort with her at all times, you know, that, that's concerning because it's, it's something that is not applied equally to all customers. Jillian Holzbauer with CARE says the woman decided not to stay and contacted them to file a complaint. We're simply asking the bank to review and revise the policy in such a way that, you know, it, it still meets their security concerns, but that it uh, allows accommodations for um, religious headwear. Valley National Bank tells us they have a no hats, no hoods, no sunglasses policy posted on their doors. The bank says it adopted the policy from the Oklahoma Bankers Association to cut down on crime. Well, first, I think there, there's a, a very clear difference between something like a ski mask and something like a hijab. You know, we, we understand the, the security concerns for sure. It, it being a bank, that's a, definitely a big concern. The bank says they sent a letter explaining the policy to CARE. The CEO even asked for the woman's address so he could apologize for making her feel unwelcome. And I assure you it's to a bank's benefit to be open to everyone in their community. David Bernstein, a member of the Tulsa Say No to Hate Coalition, would also like to see the policy changed. Being different doesn't mean they're wrong or they're against us or we should be against them. It just means you're different. I spoke to the bank's CEO by phone earlier. He told me he believes the policy is fair, and in the last six years, they've never had a complaint until now. Live in South Tulsa, Sarah Goldenberg, 2 News, works for you.